Hey everybody, Dave Short, your Oklahoma PBL president here, reporting live from the beautiful campus of TCC Metro in the beautiful city of Tulsa, Oklahoma, where everything's beautiful. I don't know why it is, but it is, and it's awesome. Home of America's largest PBL chapter, and this is the Bullseye. Bullseye is a weekly newsy type video that I put together for you to share all the exciting things that are happening inside of Oklahoma FBLA dash PBL. And yes, you do pronounce the dash. I don't know why, but then the rules. All right, kicking off this week's Bullseye, we have to talk about the amazing success of yesterday's World Prematurity Awareness Day. It's a special day that we set aside to raise awareness for the nearly half a million children who are born too early each year. And I have to say, your Oklahoma FBLA-PBL team hit it out of the park. Just a major success. Last night, the Skydance Bridge in Oklahoma City and the BOK Center here in Tulsa were brilliantly shrouded in purple light to call attention to the issue of prematurity problems that are facing so many families around the country and media outlets were on hand taking notice. As your PBL president, I couldn't tell you how excited I am that we were able to pull this off. All of our team working with city officials and event coordinators to make it happen. Because of you, we are able to help the March Dimes continue their efforts in fighting such a noble cause. And I'm just, I'm definitely grateful for your hard work. Well, the Feeding Our Communities project has been such an amazing success, so wildly popular, that we had to go back and take a second look at all the guidelines so that we can make sure that as many of our members can participate as possible. As you know, 25% of the kids in Oklahoma face some sort of hunger-related problem. And we want to take care of that issue. We want to tackle it. We want to face it head on. And that's why your state officer team has issued a challenge to each individual member of our state chapter to serve at least 10 hours with a local charity or organization that fights hunger. And if you meet this challenge, you'll be recognized at the state leadership conference in March. The top three contributors to this project will be specially awarded on stage. Now, it's very important for you to understand that our goal in this project is for you to get your hands dirty, for you to do some heavy lifting, for you to fight this head on. Be face to face, hand in hand with organizations who are taking on this issue. We want it to be a huge impact that we have. We don't want you to take up collections with your chapter and go to Whole Foods or Reesers and buy canned food. We don't want that. We want you to go to the actual organizations who are working on this. And if you're not able to volunteer at their headquarters, ask them what they need specifically. Go out into your community, collect those items, bring them back to that organization personally, and make your difference face to face. I cannot stress that enough. We want you in the trenches for this issue. Now, there is a service report template available on our website under resources at okfbla-pbl.org for you to download. So just clickety-clack the red button at the bottom of that page and get started recording your contributions. They will be due February 24th first of 2014 for you to be able to gain recognition at SLC. Now, we're going to wrap up this week's Bullseye with a special chapter shout out to TCC West and their amazing victory with Scare Away Hunger. It's a program where their members go door to door trick or treating for canned foods to donate to the Regional Food Bank of Eastern Oklahoma. And I have to say, when you hear the success of your numbers, you're just going to be blown away. 1,700 pounds of food was collected. 1,700 pounds. That's 1,400 meals. Huge, huge congratulations to TCC West. Because of you guys, children who were previously unsure of where they're going to get their next meal are able to have hearty dinner tonight. 
and I'm just so proud of you guys. You guys did a wonderful job. They are setting the example of fighting the issue of childhood hunger in our state. They even volunteer every single Wednesday at the Eastern Food Bank, uh, the Regional Food Bank of Oklahoma here in Eastern Oklahoma. Uh, congratulations to everybody out there. Well, this is another episode of The Bullseye. It's coming to an end. We've got to wrap it up. I've got to go to class and you've got other stuff to do than sit here and listen to me ramble for five minutes about all this crazy stuff. But it's pretty exciting, right? Oklahoma FBLA-PBL is doing some great things and I just want to congratulate our state chapter. Uh, next week's Bullseye will be filmed from TCC Southeast which is our newly reactivated chapter. I'm excited. Until then, we'll see you. I'm Dave Short, your Oklahoma PBL president, signing off. We'll see you next week.